guys and welcome back to my channel so today i have a collective haul with some items from clinique charlotte ruse joanne's and marshall's so without further ado let's get right into it so for the people um who are not familiar usually marshall's a lot of the stores have like clear out sales right now because they're getting ready for the springtime so i went to marshall's and i'm really not trying to buy stuff if you watch my minimalist video i picked up these towels the compared price was seven dollars they were on clearance for three but i always like to have a fresh pair of kitchen towels especially if i have guests coming over and especially when i do like a real good cleaning in my kitchen it's nice to just always have some pretty towels on hand and this is a nice blue color and this one just has like the blue trimming as well and they're from the line pure kitchen next up i picked up some sunglasses these are from Tahari and they were $12.99. I really don't have like some cute sunglasses. I used to go to New York all the time. So I used to always just be able to pick up some cute sunglasses that were cheap. Now it's like I hardly ever go there anymore. It's like I'm stuck with trying to find like some cute glasses. So these are the ones I picked up and I just thought they were cute. I actually didn't even notice this like diamond detail, but I thought this was so cute and I'm gonna actually try them on for you guys. So what do you think? Do you guys think these are cute? Again, they are Tahari brands and I just thought they were cute. Not really different, but cute to just add to my collection. I just picked up one item from Joann's. I really, I was baking during the holiday season and I broke my mini size ice cream scooper. I use it for cookie dough just to put on the parchment paper or just the cookie sheet. But this is how it looks, super simple. And this is actually a cookie scoop. The one I had before was plastic and it was considered a mini ice cream scoop. So I don't know. Now I finally have like a real cookie scoop. Next up I have Charlotte Ruth. So I am like in love with these blanket scarves and they're so big it's kind of hard to show you but I'm just I'm going to show you the actual print close up. And this is the same style. And can you believe they were $5 each? $5. I mean, blanket scarves to me is something that you can honestly utilize all year long. Because even if you are going to the beach, you can have this in your car. If you are, you know, if you're cold, you always have something with you. So for $5, you honestly can leave this in your car just in an event that you get a little chilly. I did purchase it to wear it. So again, it's super long. It's a blanket scarf. I guess this is like the holiday color, but it was only $5. So I purchased two of them. So from next up from Charlotte Roots, I purchased some big earrings and I have one of the pairs on right now. I mean, I am not sure, but these I can't believe they were only, they were two for $10 as well. And even at like the beauty supply store in my state, like they want like $10 or $15 for something like this. So, and trust me, I've been on a hunt and they've been like super expensive to find. So I will show you guys how these look. I just feel with like big hair or even a head wrap or even have a cap on like these big earrings are kind of like a statement piece and I just think they really bring out someone's attire this has like the regular gold rose gold and silver you go to Charlotte Roots to get you some big earrings now I know where to go because trust me I was looking at like the beauty supply store and they just they were super super expensive especially the ones that looked like this they were super expensive for what I was willing to pay for them next up I am super happy about this purchase this is the beyond perfect two-in-one foundation and concealer I heard about this from so many beauty bloggers 
Nitra B is actually when I was like, she said it, she loved it, I have to get it. I did purchase it and I have not used it yet. The foundation I have on right now is the Chanel foundation. Not really sure how I feel about it. I really need to try it out a couple more times before I even give an honest review. It, it is definitely a total different consistency of what I'm used to. I really would like to see what the Beyond Perfecting is like as a concealer and as foundation. I have some more items that I purchased from Marshall. This is actually a different Marshalls, but I purchased the magnet mount and this is for a car. It's the iCar magnet mount and it was $8. Not sure how well this is going to work. I was trying to think of like vlogging and just putting it on my car and then turning it. But I'm not sure if I should just invest in the ones that like you have to screw your phone in or screw your camera in. So I'm not sure about that yet, but I thought for $8, I'll give it a try. Next up, so these are just freezer and fridge bins. And what I think I'm going to do is I am going to probably label them with my label maker. And one idea I have is to have like a leftovers bin because... Usually I typically cook every single night, like Monday through Friday, typically. And then like on the weekends, we will have like leftovers or even if my son after school, if he leftover. I'm trying to see if it would be easier just to have everything labeled and put in a certain bin because a lot of times our refrigerator just gets chaotic and I even personally forget about meals. Like if I'm meal planning and things get pushed back, I forget about food that I have in the refrigerator. So I'm thinking about just, this is a designated area for like food prepping, food that has been prepped and leftovers. And next up from the Dollar Tree, I picked up some, just some random items and I'll share with you guys and I'll share the uses as well. This is just the Loose Pigment Eyeshadow. I purchased this before and loved it, but I do plan on doing like a Dollar Tree makeup video with like all Dollar Tree items. So I picked this up because I know some people use it as like a highlighter. So I thought it would be cute to try out and I'll hopefully I'll have that video up soon. I picked up these nails. I think this design, usually I'm a French manicure type of girl, but I just thought this was super fun. And I love when I travel, especially when I go out of state, to have on, you know, have my nails done. So I thought this was a really cute, inexpensive alternative. Next up, these are nylon cable ties. And a great use for these is when you are traveling, because a lot of times, because with like TSA, I'm, I don't even know if you can have a lock on your suitcases when traveling but what is a good thing is that when, when you're traveling you can put this on your luggage to have it secure you can also put it when you're staying at the hotel if you don't have any locks with you if you just wanted to tie just for peace of mind you could always tie your luggage with this as well and these 100 comes in a pack so it's really inexpensive especially if you know you have a habit of leaving stuff. I honestly would suggest to just throw a couple of these inside of your bags when you're just to have. So when you are traveling, if you do forget your lock or if your lock breaks or whatever the case is, you always have this in the bag. Okay. I have these gemstone stickers. I love pink, and but I would have gotten like the regular gemstones, like the clear ones, but I didn't see any at my store. But I love pink, so it worked out as well. And I do plan to use these to add to my planner. And next up, I just picked up these stickers. I thought these were super cute to have like little note on my planner. And this one actually has like a cute little notepad. And I also think these colors are perfect for spring as well. I'll show you this one. So I thought these were super cute. It has like summer sizzle, spring, sweet spring, enjoy today. So these are definitely for the spring. This one, it does not say. So I guess this is like a all year long theme. But I just picked them up because I thought they were super cute. I did love like the little notepads with this one. It has a camera. That is it. That is my haul. Please like, subscribe, and share. And I look forward to seeing you guys next time.